Today I'll actually be starting the Arnold split. So a couple days ago in a video, like a previous video, I had said that I was gonna start doing the Arnold split, but um, I actually had the whole split wrong. So we have it correctly now since it's, I, st I did chest, back and abs yesterday. And today I'll be doing shoulders, biceps, forearms and triceps and abs. So that's what I'll be doing today for, uh, what's it called it, my split. Um, if y'all don't know what my split is now, I just changed it. it. Well, I just started a new split starting today. Usually, like when I like the process of me building muscle, what I did to build muscle, I didn't have a split or a routine. Like I never had a split routine the whole time me grinding. Only thing I did was make sure I trained two muscles two times a week, and that's how I got bigger. But that's how you all could do. But if y'all want to be like really, you know, if y'all really want an actual routine and split. Um, there's a workout program out right now that's going to be in the link in the description. Y'all can check that out. I already uh, dropped it. Um, and I'll really be about it. Let's get to the lift. Let's do no talking. I have a question for everyone in the bathroom. Should I dump him? Right now we're gonna do the same thing for the other arm. 50 reps beyond failure. Let's get this left shoulder burning. It's time to talk one-on-one -on -one with everyone here. Listen carefully, bros. This is a revolution. Everybody asks him, what the fuck is this about? What the fuck is up with those videos, cut? You fucking up yourself, cut. Come on, Jim! It's a fucking act. There is no So we're gonna get hydrated before we start the next set. Um, I'm thinking about doing some shoulder press first before I actually get to the um until I get to the rear delt flies. Usually I just do. Well, actually, never mind. I already do rear delt flies last. That's my last exercise for shoulders. So yeah, let's just. Stick to the memo like we always do. I feel kind of dumb, but uh, I miss you. Get back to fucking work. It's time to get back to work. 
In order to train as hard as possible, you must maintain a clear image of your purpose. Once your goal is sharply, but realistically defined, all that remains is carrying out your plan. Don't, however, worry about your individual potential. Potential is only the expression of a possibility, something that can be assessed accurately only in retrospect. In other words, you'll never know how good you might have become. Time to pull up some good rear delt floss. Our shoulders are already pumped up from that, so honestly, we just gonna uh, speed this up, speed all this talking up. I really just want to get right to the set and beyond failure, so we're gonna do the uh, rear delt floss, two sets to failure, left and then right. We just gonna really get that that slow control, pause contraction, just pausing at the top, slow control, just so we can really get those rear delts burning. He's a good man, and he cares about you so much. It, it, it isn't because I don't love you. I love you with all my heart. What do you think? Hey, sorry about snapping at you earlier. Um, I thought about it, and yeah, I suppose that must have sounded kind of weird when you heard me take that other call. Plus, you're just out here in your own head. Trust me, I know how it is. So, did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. I'm actually married. But you're here. She's sick, and I shouldn't be here, but I am. I... I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, you are here, and it's beautiful, and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, sure. He's a good man. And he cares about you so much. It, it, it isn't because I don't love you. Time for biceps now. So I like to do weighted chin ups first because, you know, since I do weighted calisthenics and street lifting, basically stuff like that, I always want to start off with a weighted calisthenics exercise. It matters what day it is because, you know, of course, I can't do weighted calisthenics with legs. 
it just sucks. Weightlifting is the best type of, you know, you know, thing to do to grow your legs. But like stuff with like biceps, chest, triceps, upper body, you know, you could do a lot of weighted calisthenics with that. So like every upper body day, I always do weighted calisthenics. Maybe not on shoulder days. About to load up 50 LBS, and we just gonna rep out slow control weighted chin ups. You like me, but you won't have me. You tell me I'm pretty, but. Because you have a negative mentality, you're weak minded, and you're never gonna accomplish your goals. Because I'm telling you right now what you need to do, and you're telling me you can't do it. I can't. You can't? Are you fucking kidding me? You just said I can't? Give me the test! <laughs> We did enough on that set. So I feel like since we already went beyond failure on that set, we'll do another set, of course, like we always do. I was going to be like, nah, let's move on to the next exercise. Now that we're going to finish the job, we always get the job done. We got work to do. Let's finish the set. Failure has been achieved. Thank God. Now, the only place to go from failure is to win. Come on. Get it. some curls until failure. Well, I've been waiting on these. This is my favorite part of the bicep day. I can't wait until that 45 pound dumbbell coming. Someone would be having to do two to one minute sets on curls. Those 30 pound dumbbells take forever for me, for me to reach failure. That's why I can't wait until I get those 45 pound dumbbells. <sighs> I'll be able to do, I'll at least be able to do like the 12, the 15 rep range. Cause that's how much reps I could do with a uh, 45 pound dumbbell. About 15 reps without stopping. <sighs> Um, yeah, that's really about it that's coming in. And, uh, I'm going to have more gym equipment coming in. And I got some compression shirts coming in, too. And some anime shirts that I'm going to leave in the link in the description. It's time to talk one-on-one -on -one with everyone here. Listen carefully, bros. This is a revolution. Everybody asks him, what the fuck is this about? What the fuck is up with those videos, cut? Fuck it up with some cut. It's a fucking act. There is no sis. pound dumbbell so it could sort this out and be able to do some incline curls. The one, the only, and I call the earth, Hunter McGregor! Tomorrow, Louie, you ain't gonna make this man pay with his life, and I mean it. You're dead in that octagon tomorrow, night. I run New York City, a fucking pimp.
Rocky Dicky Mick, and without me, this whole fucking ship sink. 2015 was my year. 2016 is also my year. Every year is my fucking year. Here's a little bit new. I usually, when I train triceps, I usually implement chest and triceps. But since today, you know, well, since now we're following the Arnold split, we're specifically training only our triceps and not our chest as well. What we'll be doing here is we'll do diamond push ups, tricep extension skull crushers, and what else should we do? We'll find out. with that forearm pump, not that forearm pump, that bicep pump. Now let's get the triceps. And then we'll be able to flex that tricep pump too. I don't know what you mean. I just got a lot going on, cool. My road slipped my mind, okay? This ain't about you forgetting to take Dylan somewhere, all right? This is about the scorched earth thing you doing to the people that love you. I'm worried. You don't gotta worry about me, okay? Neither does my mom, Dylan, the bakers or whoever else can't mind their damn business. Yo, do you hear yourself right now? You are our business. Okay, so if you hurt and we hurt. You hear me? I said I'm good. End of discussion. Nah, oh, man, I've known you way too long. And you're not good. So enough with the BS. You need to let it go, all right? I'm not letting nothing go until we figure this out. No, I really don't need you on my bumper right now, man. Look, you angry. I get it. For the last exercise, well, not the last exercise, but for the last two exercises, I was thinking instead of just not instead of just doing diamond push-ups and tricep skull crushers, I could do regular push-ups, diamond push-ups, and then skull crushers. So that's what be that would be the exercise we'll be doing. The only way I wasn't killed was one man saving my life over and over. The only way you get away. He said, someone is here making sure. It's taken me years to know I can't go anymore. I asked for help. I didn't get it. To get away, you need someone on the inside. I'm that for you. I said that if you love me, up on me, one that I can see, a feeling that grabs onto my heartstrings and tells me that I'm lonely. I don't want to believe it. I have family and a few friends I can laugh and cry with, so then why do I feel this way? I'll admit most times I'm not okay, I suffer with my depression and self-hatred towards myself, so I'll push people away and isolate myself to not bother them. It's something Let's I get something to eat, get hydrated, and then we'll move on to Abdin Farms. I feel fine. But that doesn't erase how alone I feel, and I try to figure out why. 
I hesitate to call or send a message because I feel like I'm annoying. It's so hard to suppress that urge when I really do want some company. I'd rather disappear and go silent than feel like I'm bothering someone. It's even worse when the same energy isn't given, and I'm left wondering what I did wrong or if I'm just boring. None of this helps the loneliness I feel inside. I'm back, motherfucker! I'm back! We're going through some stresses in your life. The demons overcoming it right now. Most of the time, we knew the start and end point. So on the way back, I start seeing people getting happy and shit. Get it? 17. They don't know me, son. Get it? 2 a.m. Not fucking verses here. All right, scream my fucking ass off. are pretty pumped up they're not too bad pretty pumped up a little bit but now we're not done yet we're gonna do one more farm exercise this is gonna be some farm curls until failure for two sets till failure and then we're gonna move on the abs <laughs> Farms looking pumped up a little bit. Let's keep on pumping them up. Keep on pulling out them reps. One more set to failure. <laughs> Juice Dream was the scariest heavyweight that ever existed. He was a world-class kickboxer, K1 Grand Prix champion. Alistair was also a European champion in Abu Dhabi. Alistair over him can submit people too. Alistair in his prime was the fuck. All right now, let's do five sets until a fair as you know, because we're going to do multiple exercises on abs. So, I was going to say let's do five sets until a fair your leg raises, because I was going to do that as the only ab exercise, but since I got more options, I'm going to do leg raises, two sets to failure, Two sets to failure, uh, 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 what's to call it? You gonna find out, let's go. I'm back, motherfucker! Ancestors! Give me the test! I'm a hundred men!
So I'm thinking for abs, instead of just doing so many exercises, I, I learned that leg raises is like the best ab exercise you could do. So we're going to do two more sets until failure of leg raises. So we're going to do three, four, five. We're going to do, actually, never mind. Okay, so we're going to, yeah, we're going to, we, so usually, so we're going to do two sets until failure on normal uh, leg raises. And then we're going to go on a dip bar and then do two sets until failure and knee raises. So that'll be four sets in total. But I'm going to just add in like two more sets just for today, just because I want to. Failure has been achieved, thank God. Now, the only place to go from failure is to win. Come on. Let's go to sleep.